I really do feel like at Kill St. Bernard's the students are highly involved and I think that that's so different from a lot of other places and that they are encouraged and supported so much by the faculty here. They truly are working on becoming their best selves. Gill's theater program is so special because nothing is half done in that theater. Our director, Mr. Canada, really pushes us to reach our full potential and work hard and keep our grades up at school. You're dressed in these incredible costumes with these incredible sets behind you. How can you not want to give a thousand percent every day that you're there? Outside of theater, just, you know, the teachers here really care about us and, you know, they do anything they can to help us. They want us to learn, they want to teach us, and they all love to teach, which I think <laughs> really helps. I think a lot of students might not realize it till after they graduate, but the stuff that teachers will teach you here is just completely eye-opening. So everybody here, you know, wants to work hard, wants to be in the classes they have, and loves doing what they're doing. I just feel like I was very well prepared for college here. I'm not worried about, you know, the workload or making new friends because I had to do that when I was a freshman here and I just think that if college is anything like Gil then I'm gonna have a great time because I had a great experience here. <laughs> <laughs>It was an exciting day for our school on a lot of levels. We had a lot of people here, we had alums here, we had families here. It was an important conference game. We were also playing for our coach, uh, Mr. Bernardski's uh, 300th win. It was funny because every one of our teams, as the soccer team was winding down, had won that day. So it was a great day for our athletic program. And now the soccer team is in this, this tight overtime battle with a conference rival. It went to overtime, which means the first goal that scores wins the game. And that was actually a big moment for me because I scored from 45 yards out. So that gave Mr. B his 300th win and it was also my first ever varsity goal. I think Gill really looks to transform its students. It's gonna transform you not only into a very hard worker, someone that can succeed in any environment, but it's also gonna transform you into someone with strong values. It's easy to come to college and sort of lose yourself, but coming from a place like Gill, there is that sense of community, there's a sense of values, and it orients you very well in the world. I feel like they really knew what college was going to be like when I had no idea. At the time, I was like, why are they making me rewrite this paper three times? Because when I walked into college, I only had to write it once. My time at Gill really inspired a sense of curiosity and a passion for learning, and that's something that I will carry with me throughout the rest of my life. It'll transform you from, you know, uh, a, a freshman coming in that's probably worried about getting their braces off into a senior graduating with ambitions to save the world. I don't think I would have learned half of what I learned here from anyone.